Welcome to North Kern State Prison, two hours north of Los Angeles, currently holding 4,000 inmates. That's twice as many as what it was designed for, a ratio which applies to most of California's jails, where overcrowding has become a major problem. The federal government has had to step in and ask the Golden State to set 40,000 inmates free. Meanwhile, North Kern has found its own ways of coping. This gymnasium has been converted into a dormitory, which sleeps an extra 140 inmates. Come on right now, come on. Benito was convicted of second-degree murder in 1983. I forgot you were in here. I thought you went to work, Spencer. He thinks the authorities should release inmates based on their conduct and their plans. I'm doing a 17 years to life sentence and I've been down 26 years already. What I'm hoping for is that um, the governor can see that there's a whole lot of people that have been um, uh, qualified, eligible, they have eligibility and they, got, they have proved their suitability to return back to society. Bunk beds have been set up in the hall of this building to fit in the new arrivals. Leon has been here for 11 years and often acts as an intermediary between the guards and the inmates when tension mounts. But overcrowding makes his job difficult these days. Each race is like separate communities and we have to keep an open line of communication with each other in case tempers flare or something like that and we have certain people that we go talk to to keep the tension down before it explodes into a riot or something like that because of this overcrowding. Patrick was arrested 12 years ago for selling narcotics. According to him, way, some of his uh, fellow inmates should not be in prison, but in other institutions. You have a lot of violators, parole violators, who maybe, and, and, and drug abusers, who maybe it would be better served if they were uh, 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 placed in a drug program as opposed to incarcerating them. In the midst of one of its worst budget crises, California can no longer afford to house its 170,000 inmates. Releasing some of them would generate millions of dollars in savings. Before that, lawmakers need to convince the population that the measure would not pose a threat to its safety.